Hi there. I hope you like staring at the uh, moon keyboard dot. Whoop. Oh, yeah, see? Oh, don't mind the dust. Look. <laughs> what is FN anyway? What is FN? I don't know. You know what? I just came on to talk some more. Um, I, I had something that I was like supposed to do today that's really, really important. Um, but you know what? I'm not going to get there. I ju I'm not. I know I'm not. Um, I don't like putting things off, but oh, I think I'm just going to have to. I'm going to trust God that I still can do it Monday. Because, you know, certain things just like came to my mind, like the school closing and everything because of the coronavirus and, and other things are already on my mind anyway, trying to figure out bills and money and all kinds of dumb shit that I do all the time. Sorry I swear, I just get so pissed off. I, you know, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just rambling. I guess the wind's blowing like really hard today. And that's what made me think when the schools were closed and then the, the wind's blowing. I, I was sitting here with the window cracked because I, I smoke in the house, like in this room. Not always this room, but, you know, and then the wind's coming in and they have to talk about the coronavirus. So then I'm sitting there thinking that it's like coming in my window. I mean, this is stupid shit you do. Oh, it's so stupid. But but you know what? I mean, it's it's freaking possible, I would think. I don't know. Why am I talking about that? I don't know. Just because. Because that's what came to my mind today. I hate that. Did you ever get that? Something comes to your mind or, or something said or whatever. And you just can't get it out of your mind all damn day. Or or you have a dream. You have a bad dream. I should tell you about that. All right. How about this? Maybe we should just go there. <laughs> all right. I need help figuring out a dream. All right. I was driving down the freeway in a go-kart, but I had to pedal it. And there was tons of traffic, and I kept seeing it. And there was like three or four lanes. And uh, so I'm going and going and going. I was like, in my mind, I was heading west. So west from where I live, west to the left, which is strange because actually... In my mind, I was heading west, but actually, if you think about it, when I think about the map, I was actually going east. So, th there's one of those things, you know. Just like when you uh, dream about a house, but it was it was someone's house, but it wasn't their house. But, it, you know, it's like, oh my God. So, anyway, I'm, I'm driving down the freeway. I'm in a go-kart type thing, and I'm pedaling it. And in, it was going pretty fast. I was keeping up with traffic, which is really strange. I don't know how you could do that in a go-kart. So I was keeping up with traffic and everything. And the next thing you know, I seen myself. I'm getting over to my left in the left lane. And I get way over to the furthest left lane. And next thing you know, but this is after I've been driving for like quite a while. I'm going pretty far. And I kept thinking I was going to my mom's place, which she's never lived over there and that far. And, and um, I was thinking about getting there and... Next thing you know, I switch lanes, and I've been knowing, and then, then I hit this railroad track. And next thing you know, I'm on a railroad track that's all veering to the left, and, and, and it's going da 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 Every time my wheels would hit the each of the train thing, uh, it was weird. But yet I was still pedaling and still going, and next thing you know, the railroad track, which nobody could have actually been using it, and like trains, I mean, they're... <laughs> I don't know. This is just really strange. It ends. It just ends and it goes into like um cul-de-sac thing, kind of like a, a street thing. And there's a guy standing there and he had really dark hair and like kind of bushy hair and, and, and a real dark beard. And um, he looked older to me and kind of chubby, not fab, just a big, bigger guy. And old, older, you know, not old, old, but whatever. So anyway, it goes from there seeing this guy. What, what I asked him, I said, um, do you have any idea where I am? And he, he said like Wyandotte or Wixom or something. And if you go, 
on the map that would that would be more south from us way south and then it would or some of it might be the other way but anyway they start with the w and i go oh okay do do you know how you know okay where i am and all this stuff and then and then so in my mind i'm picturing it and i'm i'm seeing it all in my mind it, everything was clear and what's so strange to me is i i don't really always see dreams very very clearly you know so anyway we're at his house now next thing you know his wife walks out and, and she has like this blondish hair it's short she's taller and but she's older than him and she's talking and okay hello and whatever and then then her daughter's there and they're both wearing a dress that's probably because i done some song and wrote i need a dress which I wouldn't look good in one anyway, but don't start yelling at me that I'm getting down on myself because I wouldn't. <laughs> not, not right now with my stomach, but anyway, so we're at his house and they're all nice, very nice. The daughter was nice. The wife was nice, even though the wife talked a lot, but, but she's whatever. And then we're sitting down at the table and just jibber jabber and whatever. And then next thing you know, I'm like, well... It was like I was getting ready to go or something. And then the daughter was leaving, going somewhere too. I don't even know. I'm thinking about my go-kart, right? I'm thinking about driving my go-kart back home. So I said, well, do you know... Oh, forgot about this. Uh, he said, do you know that your tab on your, your go-kart is expired? And I'm like, no, I didn't know. So here I'm lying to the guy, but I did, but... I forgot that it would have been, you know, it, it's just so weird. So I'm lying to the guy and everything else. But I wanted to find a way to get back home that I didn't have to go back down that freeway. So, you know, he kind of told me this way that was like, you know, around the freeway type of deal and everything. It was going to take me a really long time to get home, which was weird because then I never ended up getting to my mom's house. So anyway, when I when I go to leave, I, I'm seeing familiar streets in my mind and everything, which I've never even been there. And but but the streets seem familiar, so I, I did know how to work my way back home and next thing you know I woke up. So I don't even know if I got home or what the hell I did. I hate when that happens. Have you ever tried to redream the dream to where you could find out the ending? I I, <laughs> I need to do like I, I try to do that. If I fall back asleep, I'll really sit and think about what I was dreaming to, to, to try to continue the dream. Like, what do I even care? I don't know. So, I started thinking about the dream, thinking like, well, well, that was pretty weird that the go kart was going really fast. I was keeping up with traffic, but then next thing you know, it veered off. So I thought, well, in my life, it's it's veering off. But 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 it's been veering off. My thought, well, is it a thing telling me I'm veering off in some wrong direction? Well, I'm pretty used to that. You know, I probably always do. I've always been in the wrong direction if you think about it. But but I, but I thought it was real strange that I was keeping up with traffic and I was going, but it was veering off. And, and then I see this guy. But I forgot to tell you, but before I left, the lady says to me, do you need anything? And I'm like, no, I'm all right. And then I go... Well, yeah, I do need a lot of things, but that's okay. That's what I told the lady <laughs> before I left back in my go-kart. But it was really strange because if I sit here right now, west is to my left. So when I was actually driving the other way, if I was facing the other way, west would have been to my left if I was sitting the same way I am right now. So I think in my mind, that, that was a weird thing to me, that it was actually east, but in my mind it was west. I must have been imagining. I don't know where they're... It's just weird, and then it's just some guy shows up, and they're all real friendly, and, and... I don't know, I think we ate some donuts or something when we were there. Really weird, but I wasn't there long. And why would I be going to my mom's house way the hell out there? Just pretty strange, a few weird things, so, oh well, I've been jabbering for nine minutes, thanks for listening, I, uh, I don't know, I get a lot of, like, uh, just, 
nervous about a lot of things. I, you could probably do so much more if you weren't as nervous. That I, that's why I force myself to sing and show my face or, you know, I'll force myself to do things that I don't want to. And I, I do notice I, I can't sing as much if I'm showing my face. I seem to sing better if I don't show it. Real self-conscious. I don't know. I don't know. So, if you if you boy just shut it off right now, because I probably I have four minutes left. I might I don't know. Sit here and think for a minute. I I think a lot about a lot of things. Sometimes I wish that you know I just didn't think. I would just shut it off, you know, and not have to think anymore because I do notice too, like I've said it before, that when when I do dream, it's it's those days that I wake up quite often, at least once or twice. Um, but when I woke up from that dream, this time with the go-kart deal, um, I felt really, really out of it. I... I, my eyes were all blurry. I felt out of it, like real kind of weird and everything. That's sort another of thing too. I have dreams when I don't feel well. I have dreams when I wake up often. I have dreams when I don't really sleep very deep. Maybe a couple of those will help you, but you guys probably already know. I don't know. Oh well. Okay. Thanks for listening. I, I'm gonna shut this off and hear myself and. Maybe I'll learn something. <laughs> have have a great day. I think it, yeah, it's Friday. It, it's it's one p.m. here. Uh, the kid's been on a different schedule. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Um, he been up uh, during the oh, how's it going to bed at, at about it was eleven last night. And then got up at seven. Okay, um, usually he was sleeping after school from like 4 to 8. Now he twisted the whole schedule around and, and is sleeping from about 11 till 7. He did get more sleep, but that's not going to keep happening. Um, it, it, it pushes till 1, 2, 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. Um, I even told him to set the alarm this time, which it did work that he did set it to get up at 7. I figured that'd be 8 hours it was, and... <laughs> so if I'm not up late at night in the middle of the night anymore, but I might be now because since they <coughs> cancel school for a whole month, you're going to see our schedule getting later and later and later and later. You'll start seeing me up in the middle of the night again. So so it's not that, you know, I'm avoiding people. It's just their schedule goes from back and forth all the time. And Thanks, thanks for understanding. All right. <laughs> see you later. Bye.